Hey, in this tutorial, you'll learn how to set yourself up for success with Picmonix custom playlists. Making a playlist is easy. Let's just say I'm studying farm, and next week I have a test in cardio, and I really want to nail down those hypertensives. I'll just click the three dot more menu on any subject in our content library, playlist, or Picmonic, and select add to playlist, where I can then add it to a new playlist or one that I've already created. Now, I really want to remember why and how these drugs work, so I'm going to add in some fundamentals by finding that more menu and add them in. You can literally add anything from the Picmonic app to your playlists, from individual Picmonics, entire playlists, and even your own creations. Or let's say you want to create a playlist based on anemias. So let's do this from scratch. First, search for anemia, find a Picmonic, click the more menu on the right, click add to playlist, name the playlist, now you can scroll through, search, and click the quick add to playlist button, which will automatically add any topic to the last playlist you used. Find a few, add them, super easy. Then jump into your new playlist to easily change the order of Picmonics by dragging and dropping each one into the desired order. And you can delete the ones you don't really need. And from the more menu, you'll be able to share the playlist, print, rename, or delete it. And you'd be doing your classmates a big ol' solid by sharing your playlists, whether via email or a shareable link that you can post anywhere. Pygmonic is here to help you remember more in less time. Study on, my friends.